Hey, what's up guys? My name is Charlie. Today we're going to be reacting to some more Monster Madness and it's going to be Godzilla vs. the Sea Monster from 1966. Oh boy, I've seen clips of this movie, but I've actually never watched the full movie, which is kind of disappointing. But I have seen sort of clips on YouTube of the movie and that's really about all. Um, it sort of reminds me of like Pacific Rim for some reason. I know I shouldn't compare Pacific Rim to this movie. <laughs> I don't know why I'm making that comparison, uh, but it sort of did remind me of that. Um, but uh, uh, yeah, let's uh, check out the video, shall we? Let's go. What the hell is Pacific Rim got to do with anything? Let's go. It's I don't know. They both have water. Monster <laughs> madness. Godzilla fall. Godzilla vs. the Sea Monster involves a group of people who get stranded on an island where there's a secret organization producing nuclear weapons. Okay. They capture anyone living on the island and use them as slaves. Nobody can escape yep, because this the bad guys also like have a crap. giant monster named Ebera <laughs> under their control who guards the island. Lucky for is the good guys, they find like Godzilla a sleeping or... in a cave, so they wake him up by attracting a bolt of lightning with a sword. And from there, he does battle with the enemy planes, tramples on their base, and fights Damn. Ebera. Godzilla looks like the cookie monster. <laughs> he does he likes volleyball. Looks like a cookie monster. This volleyball. is pretty awkward. Yeah, it's a bit... It's a bit... Giant claw. And doesn't the music kind of sound like James Bond? It does suddenly a little bit. <laughs> Even Mothra makes an appearance oh, in adult nice. form and has a brief encounter with Godzilla. He also fights a giant bird, which is probably the worst Godzilla fight ever because he can't even see what's going on. Yeah, oh, Jesus. Should have been the giant claw. <laughs> Originally, Godzilla's part was written for King Kong. Yeah, after King Kong vs. Godzilla, Toho followed it up with King Kong Escapes, in which Kong fights Robot Kong. Damn, But then Robot they were going to have Kong star in this movie, but decide that Godzilla would be more profitable. Uh, of course. <laughs> when you watch the movie, it seems obvious. First of all, they wake Godzilla with electricity, just mm. like in King Kong vs. Godzilla. But that was originally written for Frankenstein. Mm. So, wow, from Frankenstein to King Kong to Godzilla. Also, Damn. Godzilla <laughs> sort of has a curious romantic interest in a human female, which is another trait that's more like Kong. Yeah, this tends to be a weak quick. entry in the series. Godzilla doesn't even wake up until like an hour in. Nah. So if you want a few laughs, go for it. <laughs> Otherwise, stay away. Okay. Frodo's got the locks. Yeah, I think I'm starting to notice a pattern. The more we're going through all these Godzilla movies, the more the the look of the suits look more rubbery. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, Godzilla vs. the Sea Monster from 1966. Never watched the movie, only seen clips of it, and uh, it looks it looks alright. I mean. I mean, for for some reason, every time I see the the, the claw, I keep thinking of um, the the Jim Carrey uh, liar liar that movie, you know, liar liar or something like that. And he's like the claw, <laughs> nothing can escape the claw. Rah! <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Don't judge. <laughs> That's my attempts um, of the claw, but still. Um, yeah, that's what it reminds me of for some reason. I uh, don't know why. And it also reminds me of Pacific Rim. Don't know why. Uh, I sh don't think I should have compared that movie to this movie. <laughs> but um, yeah, I guess they both have water. That's why. <laughs> Just because they both have water. But then does the Titanic. So, uh, I mean, it doesn't make sense. Still, just go with it. Um, but yeah, if you like this video, make sure to give it a like. Comment down below. Make sure to uh, subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my content. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. <laughs>